What have you seen in your team's overall physicality mm -hmm. so far through these first handful of games? Yeah, I, I'm proud of the guys. They, they've, you know, we're a small team for the most part. Well, we've, we've fought, we've fought together. We've improved defensively. Um, you know, I think we're, we're, you know, our defense is ahead of our offense, um, which I don't think anyone was predicting coming into the year. But, uh, you know, that, that makes me happy. And I think our guys can kind of, you know, feel a sense of uh, pride in each other that they are defending. You know, we just just got back to what we what we want to do, which is is get into early action, get off the ball, attack the paint. You know, we didn't get very many pen, paid touches in the first half. You know, especially in the second quarter, uh, I think we had one rim, rim attempt, and we got to try to get in the paint and collapse the defense and play from there. So I thought we did a better job of that. I know Blake has given you physicality pretty much most of the times that he's been out there. Um, did you get the impression, A, that this meant any more to him, the way he played, and B, just can you assess his performance? It seems, at least from the outside, that this is probably his best ever of the season. Yeah, I mean... You know, we, we love uh, that Blake brings it and gives us that physicality. You know, he's also a very intelligent player. Um, you know, so he's taking charges. He's fighting on the glass. Uh, he, you know, understands our concepts defensively. And I thought offensively tonight he helped us with some screening and some, you know, so, you know, I think he made a three and some rolls and uh, finishes and just, you know, made a lot of hustle plays for us. So he's, he's you know, somebody that we've, we've come to rely on and count on. And, uh, you know, I thought he was great tonight. When you say the uh, defense is ahead of the offense, uh, was that kind of reflected in, in uh, the fourth quarter? Because you had the, that great third quarter, and then the offense kind of broke down there a little bit. Uh, yeah, I mean, we didn't defend great in the fourth quarter, but I think a part of that was, uh, you know, they, they had nothing to lose. They started lining up shots and making them. Um, Could have played better defense for sure, but also a part of it was they made some shots and went on a run. You know, that's what teams in this league can do. Um, but we weathered it. I think, you know, overall the defense was pretty solid tonight, and uh, you know, offensively it wasn't great, but uh, we found a way in the end to get it done. Was when you go from the second quarter to the third quarter, you know, second quarter I think you shot about 15 percent, and the third quarter was 15 out of 19. Was that just as simple as getting penetration and? kind of being yeah. aggressive in your driving or was there something I think, that you saw in, in their defense? <clears throat> no, I think that was a mandate for the players was to try to get in the paint, attack the paint. You know, if you're if they take it away and get off it early and we'll play on the second side. And, you know, I think that's where our team's taken a few steps in the last week and tonight we took a step back. But uh, in, that, in the third quarter, we were much better at playing quicker, creating opportunities for each other uh, by playing fast and trying to get in the paint and attack. You know, when we get passive and stationary, we allow the defense to load up on us and it makes it hard on us. I think I'd be lying if some of it, if I didn't say some of it was carelessness, but, um, you know, there's, it's still, you know, each game presents different, you know, tactical um, and emotional, you know, um, problems that you have to solve and sometimes I thought that emotionally we got a little bit off kilter and weren't making simple clear-headed decisions trying to make home runs or just careless with it so you know it's a good lesson for us I think we you know the positive is we found a way to win and and the negative is that we still realize we have we have a lot of work to do but it's been a good week for us the building getting towards better basketball offensively obviously we had two good offensive quarters tonight but um you know really two poor ones as well yeah yeah that's that's part of it but I'm, I'm really not worried about other teams you know we came into the season we spent you know almost two weeks with a different team uh, and then we lose Kyrie now it's a totally different situation so we're, we're just trying to build a new team and trying to work at uh, what this group and and what you know that's a big hole and everyone's got to step up a level and a notch and minutes and responsibility and so to find out what the best way for this group to play is a process and so we're, i've been really proud of the guys the way they've engaged in in what we're asking them to do and um our improvements we've made but it, you know it's a totally different situation and we got to work our way through it